I'm Dalini De Silva, originally from Sri Lanka. Uh, I'm a bioinformatics scientist by background and the co-founder of Jana Bio, a Cambridge-based startup. We're developing digital health solutions to improve personalized treatment for communities who are underrepresented in genomic research and clinical trials. To me, being an innovator means I get to be creative and solve problems, but it also means being able to anticipate problems and see opportunity to improve an existing product or service, and even being able to imagine it being applied to a different domain or an industry sector. Yes, I now consider myself an innovator because I'm trying to move beyond merely having an idea and thinking, oh, wouldn't, wouldn't it be great if, if things were like this? And actually moving into implementing it and thinking about that idea in terms of introducing new products and services into a market. To be honest, being referred to as an innovator used to make me feel like an imposter. But now I'm embracing it because I'm, I've got this chance to explore new ideas, take steps into entering new markets and truly getting used to feeling like an innovator. The typical stereotypes that I was also uh, thinking of were the fact that all around us we've seen uh, men being represented in this role of innovation uh, so therefore they must be cleverer um, that could not be me and also the fact that uh, perhaps you need fancy technology and patents um, to, to be really be considered an innovator but now uh, to me you can do you can be innovative in the way you do business so to me that is the new face of innovation so if i could debunk one stereotype about innovators i would say you don't need fancy technology or a dozen pat patents to your name to be considered an innovator because let's face it you're less likely to have access to such an environment if you're not from a certain background and uh, to me anybody should be able to innovate